This is for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, the Venus signs. For Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, the Venus signs. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and also comment. I do appreciate all my Virgos out here. We have nothing that's yet set in stone. So for a lot of my Virgos out here, I'm seeing that some of you are in a situation where you're getting to know somebody and wanting things to go to the next level, but it might not be there just yet. We got to hold your vision. So don't lose hope on this goal for a lot of my Virgos out here. We do got communication is the key. So for a lot of my Virgos, especially for those of you dealing with a Gemini, communication is going to be the key in order for this relationship to work. I am still doing seven for five questions for Virgo. The cash app is D-E-E-F-O-N-D-E-L. The email is there, at gmail.com. We got don't let your past hold you back. So for a lot of my Virgos, do not let your past with this cancer or this Pisces hold you back. Be bold and make the first move when it comes to moving forward relationship-wise, especially for those of you that are single and ready to mingle and try something different i'm seeing a tourist could be approaching you you can have eyes on the tours you can have a tourist coming your way at the bottom of the deck we got believing the impossible so for a lot of my virgos don't lose hope on what's next for you it's a lot coming in for you we do have somebody from the past that has something they want to say to virgo take what energy resonates of course and leave what doesn't for somebody else we have the time it just wasn't right for us so for a lot of my virgos this person feels like Almost like you came into their life at the wrong time. They weren't ready for what you were ready for. We have, I'm so attracted to you. So for a lot of my Virgos, this person is really into you. I don't react when people people mention you. Okay, so for a lot of my Virgos, this person doesn't even budge when somebody mentions you because they don't want anybody to know how much they are into you still. It was my fault, but I blame you. A lot of narcissist energy. Finding out the truth crushed me. I left when I saw you with someone. So for a lot of my Virgos, this person walked away or stepped out because they felt like you did. I look for you everywhere. So for some of my Virgos, this person looks for your traits in, in other people. It was my fault, but I blame you. Okay, so for a lot of my Virgos, yeah, they're admitting it. They know they were wrong and they know they were narcissists. They know they cheated. They know they lied and it looks like now they're trying to come back. It's like they're doubling back. They see Virgo done moved on. This is a Pisces for a lot of you. We got forgive. We do got a Pisces that's wanting forgiveness from you. You could be wanting forgiveness from a Pisces. This could be a Gemini for some of you. We got think it through. So don't lose hope just yet, Virgo. This could be with an Aries for some of you. You could have an Aries stepping in. We have step into your power. So for a lot of my Virgos, don't forget the power that you have and you know what you bring to the table. This could be with a Capricorn for some of you. We got unleash your kind of self. We got some cancer energy here. We got take a breather. So don't lose hope on what's ahead for you, Virgo. We got some Sagittarius energy here. We got focus on the positive. So stay positive. We got some Taurus energy here. We got detoxify. Don't lose hope. Stay positive. You know, detoxify that energy. Let go of somebody's energy if you need to. If this is a Pisces, let them go. I'm getting a lot of Pisces energy. Honor your feelings. A lot of you are standing on business and you're standing on what you said, you know. Keep that energy. Somebody could be dealing with a Sagittarius right now. We got focus on the positive and believe in your good luck. At the bottom of the deck, we got some Gemini energy. Somebody could be dealing with a Gemini. We got embrace the flow of life. It's something better coming in for Virgo. Prosperity's coming in. Realness is coming in. Everything's coming in for Virgo. I'm seeing you reach the top. I'm seeing nothing can really stop you at this point. Use your third eye when it comes to dealing with someone that's sick chakra. It is somebody around you that you kind of need to keep that third eye open on. Somebody could be 31 dealing with someone 31. Somebody could be 29. Some of my Virgos did make an investment recently. I am seeing that investment turn around for a lot of you. Somebody could be dealing with a Pisces. You could have a history with a Pisces. Somebody could be 22. We got meditation. So for a lot of you, meditating is going to be the key. Somebody could be 21. We got the angel of patience. So for a lot of my Virgos that are losing patience when it comes to this situation, the angel of patience is coming in for you. You go keep that out, Virgo. Things are going to end up working out. We got a buddy coming in. So just because you're being patient and not losing hope and keeping that faith and keeping that prosperity going and keeping that energy going, I'm seeing abundance come your way. I appreciate every single Virgo. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. We got ease and grace coming in for Virgo. Some of you, this is going to require taking a step back in order to get to this point mentally if you're not there yet. So take what energy resonates and leave what doesn't for somebody else. It's time to take control, take charge of the situation, take control over your feelings. It's something better coming in for you. But you're going to have to be brave, be courageous, and 
be willing to take that step even if this requires you to get outside your comfort zone you do have a guardian angel somebody that you love and somebody that really looks after you somebody that you could have lost recently or a while back protecting you right now i do appreciate every single virgo thank you